one of the biggest hip-hop dance competitions of the year themed The Heat or Niet in Vietnamese wrapped up in Hanoi on May the 25th. And unlike previous events, this year's competition was attended by world-renowned hip-hop choreographer and dancer Henry Link. The hip-hop dance legend brought a fresh breeze to the annual dance competition and at the same time inspired the country's hip-hop dance scene. In On the Mic this week, Henry Ling will share with us the story of his stay in Vietnam. One of the living legends of the world's hip-hop dance. Working as choreographer for world's renowned artists. Traveling to different countries to inspire young people about the culture. That's American choreographer Henry Link. At this time, he's in Vietnam to attend the annual hip-hop dance competition as judge. It's an opportunity for the Vietnamese dancers to see their idol with their own eyes and even learn from him. During the visit, Henry hosted several workshops for Vietnamese dancers before working as judge for the Heat Dance Competition. And the hip-hop legend briefly reveals about himself. Just in the club, just dancing for fun, and someone just asked me to dance in a music video. Michael, Will Smith, Mariah Carey, Jermaine Dupri, it's many. Of course, working with Michael Jackson is a milestone but actually working with almost every artist is a milestone because, you know, it just say how good you're doing with your dance and what you're doing with it. You know, Michael is the top, but everybody's a milestone. No, I love dancing, so I can I, um, see how I can feel tired. It's life, that's the meaning. You know, do something you love to do and not have to worry about Someone telling you don't do it. Soon after his arrival, Henry came to the studio where he hosts a workshop for Vietnamese dancers. This is the first workshop he ever did in Vietnam. I knew I was going to be in Asia from April, middle of April to the beginning of June. So I told her I can come then around this time. It's like a workshop to teach them the foundation of hip-hop and what is hip-hop. The first time I've been here and see this many dancers, so it's good. Many other places I go to, first time I go there, first time before, going there, there was I couldn't find no dancers. Phuong, the leader of New York style hip-hop crew and others had to book four months in advance to invite Henry to Vietnam. Though it took them a lot of efforts, Phuong believes Henry's visit would help Vietnamese dancers a lot in improving their skills. Henry Linh như một huyền thoại sống về hip hop, trình độ của Henry Linh thì không phải nói rồi, nó như là một cái thần tượng của giới trẻ. New York Style đã nghĩ là làm sao mà tổ chức một cái sự kiện liên quan đến hip hop mà xin các nhà tài trợ để làm sao mà đưa được Henry Linh về đây với giới trẻ hip hop thì mọi người sẽ được gọi là cọ sát nhiều hơn nữa để cho đan sơ của mình với mục đích là để cho đan sơ của mình được cọ sát và học hỏi để lớn mạnh hơn nữa. Chú ấy là một gọi là một người đi đầu trong hip hop và bọn em muốn biết là những cái kiến thức thợ ca sâu hơn với cả những cái kỹ thuật chuẩn hơn. Qua buổi workshop này chúng em học được rất nhiều và hy vọng trong buổi chiều nay nữa chúng ta em sẽ tham gia giải đấu sẽ thành công nữa. Lần đầu tiên em có thể học được kỹ như vậy, không nó chỉ về không chỉ về các bước nhảy mà còn cả về âm nhạc nữa. Khá là khó. <cười> Mặc dù cũng tập cũng khá lâu lâu rồi. And with some extra knowledge gained from the workshop, these dancers are ready to compete in the heat competition. Held annually by the New York style, the heat has become an event that hip-hop dancers across Vietnam don't want to miss. 
not only showing dance moves and exciting music beats, the event is also a place where young people express themselves and share the passion of the hip-hop culture that has become a phenomenon worldwide. And the event this year has become even more attractive with the presence of hip-hop legend Henry Link. Early in the afternoon, dancers from all the best crews, some even come from Da Nang and Ho Chi Minh City, registered for the qualification round. And even from this round, Henry Ling, as the judge, has pointed out some weaknesses of Vietnamese dancers. The criteria for this part, for any part, any competition, you have to dance to the music. You have to be on beat. If you're not on beat, it's like, why, why are you dancing? They think too much. And some people don't don't listen to the music, so their rhythm is off. And they're just doing a lot of movement. A lot of them I see potential, but a lot of them I see just want to do something to make the crowd go, oh, oh, but they're not dancing to the song. However, looking at the enthusiasm of the young dancers, Henry Ling is quite optimistic about the development of hip hop dance in Vietnam. My general opinion so far is good because years ago you had nothing, now you have. So my dream is great. The final round of the heat competition took place in Foreign Trade University, Hanoi. All the best dancers getting to this round had to show all the best dance moves to impress the judge to advance to the next rounds. And the extra criteria for this round is the aggressiveness that dancers show to defeat their opponents. A lot of real battle mentality, like aggressiveness is, is good. You know, not just a dance competition, a battle. Like, it's more like uh, saying to each other, you're going to respect me. You're going to respect my dance. This is a battle. But with his experiences from dance battles worldwide, Henry easily selected the best for the next rounds. <laughs> decision because when I'm when I'm judging I'm going first round who won first round so I'm going that's why you see me moving my hands I'm going like this I'm counting who wins first and second round third round and the team that win the most and if you if a team do a routine and the other team don't don't answer with a routine this team already is winning they get another point <laughs> and most contestants were impressed with the decision of Henry Link. Có một vị giám khảo từ nước ngoài đến là Henry Link và tụi em rất là ngưỡng mộ vị giám khảo này nên là quyết tâm bay ra đây để gặp. Ông ấy đi workshop rất nhiều nơi trên thế giới từ Nhật, từ Anh, Mỹ và hiện tại đang đến Việt Nam truyền bá hip hop về Việt Nam. Đấy là một điều các dancer ở Việt Nam thật là tự hào. Năm nay thì không những mời được Đúng là trọng tài nước ngoài mà còn mời được một trong ba người sáng lập ra cái thể loại mà em đang chơi. Thực sự đấy là một cái điều quá hạnh phúc. And Henry is satisfied with the result. Well, a lot of them having problems adapting, but I see them trying. That's why I say, you can see them trying, saying to themselves, I need to learn. Because they having problems adapting, but you see them really trying to do it. A short visit, but Henry has left his great inspiration in every young dancers in the country.